What's good, buddy? It's back in the video. Today, we're going to be talking about some movement that you can use online on Demon Slayer in the Comic Chronicles. Um, yes, push block is very OP, and you know, a lot of it can be stopped. But these are ways to help you bait and help learn how to move around pretty good in this game. So, for the first thing I want to do is dash cancels. Now, for this, the reason for this, what you want to do is press R1. You want to press O, R1, O, R1. Or you could do O, uh, evade. O, evade. You know what I'm saying? Like that. And the reason for that is is to bait or have people guessing what are you going to do next, you know what I'm saying? Like, what are you going to do next? They don't know because you're over here faking the, the uh, dashes out. They won't expect anything. They don't know what to do, you know what I'm saying? You could bait them to doing something and then you could punish them for doing something for you baiting them. Or you could jump over them, dash forward, and even do the dive attack. Um, you know, you could stop a combo and then see how I jumped. Oh, so what you want to do is dash forward, jump, evade, and then diagonal. Uh, square to do like a uh, dive attack a lot of people say the jump mix ups don't work but to me they do work because they would bait somebody to doing something to me it does work because even if someone's swinging you jump over them like that boom now you got now you got a full combo you know um just movement I think movement is very key moving around like how I'm moving right now is very key to keep your opponent guessing what are you gonna do next you know they won't they might not know especially button mashers um you know they think you're gonna run towards them but then now you're jumping over them or now you're baiting out the uh the dash they don't know what to do um as you can see look i jumped over him evaded forward and the diagonal back and went back towards him to get in the combo um obviously they can push block they can block that so then you call an assist out and you know you figure out for so this is for push blockers what you want to do is fake the dash and grab you know if they're push blocking like crazy and they're just standing there blocking just act like you're gonna attack forward and then just grab them. Um, another thing you can do, obviously, is you can call an assist out, keep them in block. They can obviously push block that too, but they can't push block a grab. So the grab will still work as long as you're close to them. Um, here is a the dash, the change dash. You know what you want to do is you want to uh, dash with the f your first character first, then switch and then dash forward. You know, obviously. It's not as strong as it is in Storm, where you could switch back to the other character. But this game, you know, for me, that's not the best thing you want to do and keep doing. Um, you can also break guard with uh, the, the charge attack. So if you're still close, even though they 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 uh, push block, you can still hit them. The assist keeps them in a place. Here, just a little mix up. Obviously, you know, push block is a thing, but you can call an assist to keep them in place. Obviously, they won't just stand here and take all this. But it's just movement, you know, canceling your attacks. Moving this way, moving behind them may also help in some type of ways. So here I'm going to show some heavy cancels so that you can heavy dash forward, fake back. Look, fake a lot of fakes you can do to those people. The heavy dash cancel, actually, I just figured this tech out just now. Um, the dash is actually really strong. I'm going to show you guys a lot of things you can do with the, the heavy. Look, faked it out. Boom, boom, boom. Now I'm over here doing a combo. Uh, also, it can bait people from doing things. Look, nope. I dash away. Look, I can eat that. Look, now I'm, now I'm punishing you for that. You know what I'm saying? So it's the the heavy is actually really good. The problem is you lose a bar when you cancel it, but you can get a punch. You know, as you can see, look, he he went for the heavy too. I faked it. I went a dash behind him. A good way to parry is to when you see the special move on the right side of the screen. As soon as you see that pop up, you can go for a parry. I think that is the best way, and that's how I use it. The best way for it to work for me: push block, and then you can go for parry if someone's mashing. Um, you're saying I think you can even parry and assist. Usually when I see the, the the special move come up in the corner, as soon as it pops up, you can go for a parry, and then it should work because they can't cancel a special move until a little bit later into it. As you can see, uh, the heavy cancels, they work really good. You can eat through moves, look, I just ate through that. Dash that, look at how good, that's, to me, that's really good, you know. Um, look, I'm eating his moves, now I'm behind him, now I'm going to punish him for doing a super move that he still hit me, but because I did the super arm move, I was able to get behind him by canceling it. Parry, you know, uh, parries is really good too, man. Anytime you see a charge attack, parries can also work really good against that. Um, you know, look, super, look, dash forward, cancel, dash forward, block. Look, 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 look how crazy the super, the heavies. Look, I can, I just ate through his special move. You can also eat through special moves with the the heavy, uh, the heavy attack. So someone's mashing special moves, you know, just give them the heavy attack. The heavy attack can also be canceled. It's very safe because you know. You're able to move a certain way. Obviously, there I went for a, a sis grab. You always want to be on the movement. You know, what I'm saying someone's mashing. You know, you want to always be on the movement. You never want to be still. 
Look, boom, jumps over that. Look, jumping is safe. People sometimes jump is will help you. I don't know why people say that jumping doesn't help. Jumping does help. You can even dash towards. I got to, you saw there. I just dashed to his special move and I was able to hit him out of it. Look, look, able to eat some of that and now I'm punishing him for using the heavy. You know, uh, obviously you don't have to do the heavy attack there. You can just move to the left and da dash away from that. But you know, here's a parry. I'm starting to learn the parry a little bit more. Just showing it off a little bit. Look, boom. Look, the jump over. I, how I jumped over that. Look, I ate his special move. Now I'm gonna punish him for doing the special move. Meanwhile, he hit me. But because I did the charge attack, I'm able to move away from it. <laughs> the heavy does work really good, guys. It does work. Yes, you lose bar for canceling it. Look, people say that jump don't work. The jump does work. You can jump over people and you can get a combo for it. Look, fake the dash. Look. Uh, obviously, there, I punished him for doing the heavy attack, the jump, you know. Like I said, jumping is also another key movement. I believe that jumping can also really help. Obviously, the heavies can also really help. You eat through a move, especially a special move. Here, you can do that. You can jump. Uh, you don't really have to do that because you can obviously do the, the dash to get up there to save your meter. But I'm still going to do it right here. And then after this, you know, you can also do an evade. Boom. Now you can do ground combos. For this, uh, now you can call in your assist mid combo. And now you can get the other side. So that's what I usually do there to get the other side. Um for this you know block strings you know you can switch keep your opponent in place obviously they can push block but if, you, if they push block and you call your switch your character you should be able to hit them and then you can break the guard you know obviously they can still push block as much as they want but it's this is the way to keep pressure you know what i'm saying keep pressure um I'm trying to see what else uh you know obviously jump cancels they do work i don't know why people say they don't i've done it a lot of times to where i baited people to doing things because i jumped over them or you know they they do the charge when I'm dashing forward towards them. They do the charge heavy. I jump over them. Then I get the diagonal uh, dive attack. Look at the cancel. Like this, is what I'm saying the charge heavy. It seems like it's a very good thing to use. I don't. I, I like I said. I just learned that you can cancel it this good. Here's a little air combo. You know, keep in place. Air movement. Move uh, combo canceling movement. Um, you know that's it works really good. Keep in flip grab, assist into grab. Just pressuring somebody in a way. I know it's very hard to do in this game because of the fact that push block is very safe. Um, here's loops that you can do with characters. Certain characters have loops like these to where it's like an infinite in a way. Uh, Willy, Zenetsu, and I think Mokomo can also do it. But as you can see, look, not a lot of characters can do this, but Zenetsu is one of them that can do that. Um, now for Mokomo, she has a lot of tech. So right here, look, you can cancel with the evade and boom, look at that. She... I, I'm actually interested in learning her a lot more now. But before we get into her, I want to show you guys. So look, after you use your assist, if once you awaken, you get your assist back. So look, I'm going to use my assist again. And I'm going to go into Surge. Boom. Now I got my assist back. For those of you guys who don't know that, that's the thing. So Makomo, she has loops also. As you can see, after these kicks, boom, boom. Here's some movement. Obviously, this is different. Like, if you want to do extra tech like that, it's pretty cool that Makomo has stuff like that. Now, I actually really want to learn her now a lot more because of the fact that she has movement like that it's pretty freaking dope um but let me know what you guys think um you guys want to this is a, a little this is not the most advanced movement this is some of the movement that i use in the game to keep me you know going online wise and really to bait people obviously right there you can you can go for a reset and go for a grab at that moment that i just did um Obviously, I didn't do it there because I didn't think about it till now. That you can actually go for a grab if someone's holding block. Right here, she has like little overhead, like you could evade over them type stuff. She's looking kind of fun, man. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie at all. That she, the stuff that she can do looks kind of fun. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed seeing the video. Let me know what you guys think about this movement. Let me know what movement you guys know so I can learn. You know, I'm still learning as I keep playing. Um, if you guys want to see Makomo, I'm definitely down to do her too. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed seeing the video. Let me know what you guys think. And yeah, I'm out. Peace.